deserved any other bones. <laughs> look, he's all eaten away. Better not look. Well, you'd better bone up on your horror movie knowledge to be prepared for our next program. Because you're going to... You're going to have to excuse me because someone's at the door. I'll just take a look. It won't take long, really. That's such a long walk, you know? Yeah, talk about jobs. You know. I know a guy who had so much work to do at his job that with his boss's approval, he had himself cloned and sent the clone to work while he worked at home. A clone? One day he gets a call from his boss telling him to come over quick. Because his clone is swearing at everyone almost non-stop. Oh, man. So he goes to work and finds the clone on the 13th floor saying improper things to everyone. Oh, and he gets into a fight with him oh, and my. throws the clone out a window and it falls to its death. Oh, my gosh. Then the police come and arrest him. What? You know what they charge him with? What they charge him with? Making an obscene clone fall. <laughs> to William Taylor of Thibodeau, Louisiana for that joke. Yes, I am. Thank you for it, believe it or not. Good night, everybody. Are you surprised that we're doing jokes from different regions? Those from Louisiana? That reminds me of a joke. You know, uh, guy comes and says, hey, my name is Tex, and he says, well, you must be from Texas. And he said, no, I'm from Louisiana. And he said, well, then why do they call you Tex? And he said, because I got tired of being called Louise. That's the bonus joke for you. you know, don't say this program doesn't give you your money's worth. I didn't know we were charging, but that's all right. I'll put it on the cuff. I've got two cups. I'll see you next week, right? Okay, see you then. Thank you, Bay Area.